Hello, hello. Okay, so I've had so many people ask how I make container system, and if you are like, what's container system? Just maybe disregard. Um, I'm gonna give you like a quick premise, but I'm gonna show you just how simple you can make meal planning, okay? I'm gonna share. Where'd it go? Um, okay. This, actually, hang on, I wanna make sure that was the right. Okay, so I, um, there we go. I follow the portion fix container. This is for plan A, okay? So basically, I am allotted four green containers, vegetables, four red containers, proteins, two purples, a fruit, a blue, um, which is like healthy fats, two yellows, and four teaspoons, okay? So I'm going to quickly put in everything I eat and show you. So I'm gonna start with the things that I eat on the everyday basis um, so that it's super simple. And I should tell you that the only way, the reason I know this counts as um, this container is because I have a workbook and inside the workbook is a what everything counts for. Okay, so overnight's oats is a yellow and a teaspoon. A teaspoon is the almond milk. It's probably not even quite, it's probably not almost, all, or it's probably not all the almond milk, but it's close. Um, okay, so I decided because I really love, um, I, I use this recovery formula and I love mixing it with Greek yogurt and Greek yogurt counts as a red. So every other day I'm going to have, um, I'm gonna have lunch meat. You're like, wait, yeah, so this is my like first meal of the day and I don't really matter, it doesn't really matter. I know when the, here I can put like meal one, um, lunch, meat, overnight, oops, overnight oats, okay? And then I'm gonna do the recover pudding and then I'm gonna do this and I'm gonna do, 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 do. and then I'm gonna, Okay, so technically recover isn't gonna, I'm not gonna count that as a meal to, you'll know the difference, okay? Then I'm gonna have Shakeology, so Shakeology counts as a red, um, just the actual protein of it counts as a red. And I make it with almond milk always, so I'm gonna put it um, teaspoon, one teaspoon counts as, um, or almond milk, and I always put a half of banana. Okay, so every other day I'm gonna have a shake that has more than, that has two servings of, oh no, wait, sorry, always has a half of banana. But every other day I'm going to have more fruit in my Shakeology. So like I might put a cup of strawberries or I might put berries, but I'm gonna skip so that um, these days that I need more fruit, I might have, you know, um, one days. You get to, um, like the little cuties, you get two of those, so two cuties, okay? So there is my Shakeology. Um, if, you're, if you're someone who can, adding spinach um, is a great option. Um, I add, frozen cauliflower rice, oops, oops, so that gets one whole green. Okay, now um, I have three greens and two reds and one yellow and one teaspoon left. So I'm going to do, um, I'm going to have, I usually do like a sausage or a chicken um, for my, we'll call that meal three. And I do either a sausage, zucchini, or a chicken, zucchini, or a sausage, Green bean, chicken, green bean, 
Okay, so that kind of you can. Um, so let's actually call this meal three. It's for sake of keeping it really clear as to since I put the combo in there, then I'm, oops, duh, meal three. Okay, so we still have a blue, I still have a yellow, and I still have two greens left. So um, I know for dinner, meal four, and then we're just calling them meals, even though technically they're not meals. Um, for dinner, I don't have carbs or fruit after three. So um, I'm going to call, okay, so meal two is my typology. Okay, and then meal four is going to be, that's going to be my, um, it's going to be dinner, that's going to be dinner. Um, okay, so this is going to be either, Interesting. Okay. So I'm probably going to have uh, a beach bar here and carrots. Oops. So a beach bar counts as a half of a yellow and a half of a red. Um, and you know what's going to have to cut so this is great that you guys get to see this this is out because i still need to have dinner so i won't get to have my recover pudding i will just have to have um recovery actually is a free food i've just mixed with water um so that's usually how i drink it so i'm going to cancel that because i know this is going to be Meal five, because my dinner always has protein and vegetable. So we know meal five. Why did I do this to say? Okay, so now meal five. Okay, then, so on this meal four, on the day that I'm having the oranges, that could be meal four. Or I could have, I could eat it with my um, recovery or whenever I could put those, these things, but you could just do meal four um, and a fruit here. So then this is gonna be meal four. And here's what the faint nice thing is. Maybe I want to make some energy balls. Maybe I want to make some Shakeology balls. Maybe I want to have, I have all, because this technically only counts as a half of a yellow and a half of a red. So, and I'm not going to eat two beach bars, but what I might do is have um, half of, or eat the beach bar and have um, an energy ball. And now I have fulfilled the other half of that red and eat um, red and yellow. Cool. Simple enough. But then I also know, I'm going to show you because I'm going to change this up here. Um, I also know, okay, so this is your, this has like nuts or cheese. So depending on what I'm having for dinner. So for example, let me just pull up Shoot, let me just grab my meal plan for this week um, because that will help me. So for dinner, like tonight is, no, no, no. Oh, why did I think we were having Oh, 
Okay. Um, if your dinner has cheese in it, then you would put that for dinner. If you don't have your cheese, then maybe you want to do, um, we can call this Miss uh, miscellaneous meal um, just call that a snack um, and we can put this can be the snack so you could put it depending on if it's not in the dinner then you could just grab you know 12 almonds um, you just have to make sure you remember to get the right amounts of things so um, oh wait where's this guy oh this is meal four Okay, um, on Saturday, we always have pizza. So I am going to, I'm going to skip having this and this will be pizza. And that's already pizza. Um, and then this will be pizza. No. Okay, meal five, snack, snack. So yeah, so that snack can be, you know, this morning, just for example, I noticed that I was rather hungry after, um, after having my shake. And so I could have easily thrown in, I could have had my, you know, I could have some nuts right there or I could have, Something along those lines. So here's my like trusty dusty here. Um, so for I'm still one of my teaspoons. So you can head over um, to your, you know, you've got your. This is my yellow container. Um, I'm looking for blue. So some other options: avocado, pistachios, um, cheese. Um, so like. Instead of a beach bar, I could do cheese and crackers um, because you can have cheese and crackers. You know, like things that you, you know, you could really start doing it instead of having um, those things. So you can have, um, you could have some pita bread. I could, you could have English muffin. You could have a bagel. You could have a tortilla. Um, Popcorn, potatoes. Anyway, I just want to give you some ideas for that yellow instead if you didn't want to have a beach bar or you didn't have beach bars. Um, and then your teaspoons are your oils, right? So I always cook with oil um, for dinner, so that's going to be meal five. 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 Meal five. Meal five. Okay. And that is it. So I hope that that's helpful. Um, I hope that that gives you, oh, I am forgetting an entire container. This is your orange container, which is your um, seeds and um, dressings so this is kind of a challenging one because a lot of times maybe you don't you know I'm not a salad eater really anymore but if obviously if I have a salad for say meal three then this is where that could go um, we don't sometimes we have salads for dinner but it's just very very rare so this is when you could do a couple things you could take an orange container and throw it in your shake um, which would be flaxseed um, chia seeds um, my husband who needs an orange, he just does 10 olives. Um, I actually really like coconut, the unsweetened. So I usually put, that's usually what goes into my meal too. Unless I'm having a salad, then I would save that and I would just not put it in my Shakeology. Um, sunflower seeds, sesame seeds, um, all the things. So I'm gonna change these to the actual name.
Okay, so we're going to say man. So if you are watching this and this made sense to you or it did not, I would love to hear from you. I am here to help. Um, if you are watching this and you are like, wow, I don't know any of the things, but I would like to know everything, then please reach out and I will happily oops, get you set up. And then mail to, oops. Okay, sorry, I had brain fart there. And you'll. Okay. So let's say I wanted to have, like, I was going out for like a big salad or dinner or something. I could cancel out putting cauliflower in my shake and I could just add more. Um, I could just save it and put it towards my dinner later. That's the nice part is if you know what's your what's for dinner, then you can take those things and you can here actually it's gonna show you. So I'm gonna just pop over, grab this image here. Hang on. So like here's my meal plan. Oh shoot, you're not gonna let me do that, are you? No, hold on, let me just grab this image and then I can show you guys. Well, well you could put your dinner, so you could put like Monday, cowboy, chicken, so that has like a blue. Um, that's, a, that's a green, red, B. Tuesday is a, um, egg roll, roll. So it's a green, red, and an orange. Wednesday is, ooh. oh, I actually don't need that. I know where it is. <laughs> where am I going? Wednesday is a shrimp stir fry. A green and a red. Always um, a teaspoon. But sometimes I'm really bad at putting that there. Always a teaspoon. Okay, and then Thursday. Oops. Is chicken satay. So if I wanted to say change it up, um, this meal is really good with pasta um, and rice. So I could say, okay, Thursday I'm going to do a green, a red, a blue, a teaspoon, and a yellow, just to throw it up, throw it out. Um, I know that I don't usually have. To, um, carbs after three, but every once in a while, it is um, it's okay, and it's actually really great to kind of give your body like a change up. Friday, we always have um, chicken and veg. Sometimes we have potatoes with that, so again, you could just make a judgment. Um, and then Saturday is pizza. So fun fact, we found the best cauliflower crust. So I'm still gonna count it as yellow because I feel like there's some flower in there hiding and it's a blue and a yellow. And then Sunday, what is for Sunday? Oh, a chicken fried rice, that's right. That's a green, a red, and a teaspoon made with um, hey, well, you guys, I hope that was helpful. Um, please send me your feedback if that was 
um, you know, helpful at all. So like you could fill in, so um, Monday, this is meal five. Um, and Tuesday, meal five. And Wednesday, we're good. So Wednesday, I'm gonna have to have, you know, maybe I'm gonna probably do almonds. I really like almonds. Um, and then Thursday, I could do, um, you could, it's blue, so meal five. And you could decide if you wanted to do that. Um, Friday, I'm good. Saturday, meal five and meal five. Sunday, we're good. Okay, so I hope you enjoyed. Um, share if, to anyone you need to share this with. And thank you so much for watching. And um, be sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel um, for any and all updates. Okay, bye.